there just by coming in. Coming in. Good morning, guys. As you can see, we are so excited to be talking about this year's Lafayette Reads Together book. We are reading Hobbin, and here with us to talk about it this morning, we have Keith and we have Joan. Good morning, guys. Good morning, Good morning Abby. Thank Good you morning, so much Abby. for waking up so early for us. So we talked a little bit about the book before. It's about this woman, she's deaf blind. Mm -hmm. She went to Harvard Law and it sort of takes us through her life. It does, it's fantastic. We get to learn all of the uh, struggles that she's had, all the victories that she's had. And what's fantastic is we, we learn more about her, we learn more about ourselves and technology. Like Hobbin living in this day and age, one thing that she was able to do was to hook up um, a, her braille machine to a Bluetooth keyboard to be able to communicate with people in real time. And it's just an amazing thing. She's an amazing person, an amazing writer, uh, very gifted. And we're lucky enough to have her book for Lafayette Reads Together to read, share, and discuss. So neat. And something I love about Lafayette Reads Together is it really is something we can all read together. Adults, teens, this is a, an inspiring story for everyone of all ages. And it's one that we can all get our hands on too, right, John? Exactly, exactly. Um, the Lafayette Public Library Foundation is a, is a partner in Lafayette Reads Together, and um, we, we help provide books available for the community just by visiting one of your local branches uh, to be able to participate in the program in, La in Lafayette Reads Together. And you can, uh, you can obtain them at any of the branches just by coming in. So uh, we love this program because it en engages our community in reading, and we, the Lafayette Public Library Foundation loves it as well because it is a way that we can explore ourselves and our world um, through doing something together. It's so special to be able to read together and then discuss the book. There are going to be a lot of community involvement activities mm -hmm. that go with the book too, which is a neat part of this. And when does that all start, Keith? It starts January 19th. You, whenever you get your copy of the book, you'll actually have a bookmark that has the community partners and their events going on, the, the events that we'll have through the library. We'll have some things online, uh, but you can get your book January 19th at, while supplies last all the way through March 14th. Okay, so come out next week because you don't want to miss this read. We're going to be talking about it a little more throughout the morning. Stay right here. Guys, back to you.